This film has been prepared by Bena Denmark based on models and work methods used daily in connection with the construction of the new line between Copenhagen and Reingstel. In the film you will be presented with some of the many advantages associated with using 3D on large construction projects. Bena Denmark carry out routine laser scans of the entire 60 km long distance between Copenhagen and Reingstel, where the new line is currently being built. The result of this scanning is millions of points, which altogether produce a so-called point cloud, and draw a detailed picture of the terrain where the line is to be built, which give an understanding of the existing terrain. The point cloud as a 3D landscape can be used when visualizations are to be made of the new line construction. The visualization here shows a 3D model of Ku North Station, which has been changed to point clouds and inserted into the 3D landscape created by the laser scanning. This technique, where 3D models of future projects are combined with point clouds, is a new technique invented by Bena Denmark. By using 3D models, you can create a virtual model of the entire project and find possible faults on screen, which can be solved before work starts in the field. The use of 3D models makes it possible to ensure free passage for the train in tunnels, under bridges and across the landscape. Models from different crafts are put together and used for varying purposes. By making a cross-section of the 3D model, you can also make drawings. The 3D models are also used to make visualizations and inform how the project will look when work in the field has been completed. Simulations are a useful tool in the planning of large, complex construction works. The example below shows how Bena Denmark's building contractor has planned the assemblage of the new railway bridge over a motorway intersection in Valensbeck. The focus here is on the building process and by way of example gives an overview of where the cranes which lift the elements into place need to be situated and how they need to be moved as construction progresses. Three D is also an important tool when Bena Denmark communicates with the outside world in connection with future railway projects. With three D films and visualizations based upon three D technology, you can easily and clearly show citizens, neighbours, and landowners what is to be built in their surrounding neighbourhoods. The series of pictures show the situation before and after, at various places along the route and are used at resident meetings and in communication with interested parties. 3D models of the new line also form the basis for quantity measurements. This means that with great accuracy, Bena Denmark can calculate how much soil must be moved to create room for the new line. If there is a discrepancy between quantities specified by a building contractor and Bena Denmark's expectation, these can be compared, documented and discussed on a documented basis. In the model here, the different colours depict where there is a surplus of soil to be removed and which areas need additional soil. 3D is also an excellent analysis tool when new rail projects are to be designed and built. One can make a cross-section if all models are put together, with a desired interval or just at a random place, 
thereby ensuring everything is linked together and that there are no conflicts between the models. Bene Denmark carry out different types of control of the models and drawings. In addition to ensuring free passage for the train, the purpose is also to ensure the quality of delivered data and that it can be used by both operations and during later renovation tasks. Below is shown an example of a control chart, where Bene Denmark conducts control with the building contractor's 3D models. As you have seen in this film, Bene Denmark utilizes 3D to solve a wide range of challenges. The work methods you have seen in this film will in the future be employed by all of Bene Denmark's major renewal projects. Thank you.